Mel Warren Alvon, and I'm the CEO of T-Shirt Factory Nigeria. I also run T-Shirt Factory Ghana and T-Shirt Factory Africa. T-Shirt Factory Nigeria grew out of the need to meet corporate clients with quality products, quality branded apparels. And though we started by producing for individuals and we took that concept of making customized t-shirts for individuals and we took that concept and deployed it in the corporate environment. So other than when we usually get the plain t-shirts probably imported from China and just brand the company logo on them, what we provide is a better option which is a combination of the company colors to produce t-shirts that I like to call a brand fit for corporate organization. At the onset I just wanted something that will communicate to what we do. I remember um, writing on a board that was with them, um, two or three people then. I remember writing on a board that I wrote the names of the two biggest competitors in the country and I now wrote the name I, I wanted to use then, which was T-Shirt Factory Nigeria. I remember asking if you want to produce branded T-shirts out of those three names who, without knowing anything about the company, which of those three names would you would you pick? And of course it was obvious you would then call T-Shirt Factory. Nigeria. First, we, we get advice from clients. When we get that, we get to find out does the client do they have um, a design? If they don't, we provide design options for them. And when they pick a particular one they prefer, we now go ahead to source fabrics. We work with both the local fabrics and the imported ones. After that, the cutting process goes on. Um, the sewing, the stitching, when the sewing is complete, the buttons, everything is completed. We now go ahead and print. After printing, we package and deliver. We work with both local and imported fabrics, but 75% of the fabric we use are homemade here in Nigeria. We have various options, but I guarantee you we work with only the best. In fact, there's primarily just one or two Nigerian fabrics we use, which we feel are the best quality. That is what we use for, for our clients. We also have different campaigns. During Valentine, we we went beyond just having Valentine t-shirts, but this year we incorporated African fabrics and the campaign was really about celebrating Valentine the African way. So we had the t-shirts with African fabrics on it and also words of love in Nigerian languages or African languages printed on the t-shirts. lift the brand up and because the brand is high up there anyone that looks up is very visible you see the brand it gets into your consciousness when you now require t-shirts the first thing to pop into your mind would be t-shirt factory nigeria and interestingly i can tell you a few people have started seeing the brand and two weeks ago we had someone who came all the way from france and he wants us to um, produce African t-shirts and African tops for the brand then in France. The, the selling point for them is that they need the products to be produced in Africa. So they were looking for a company who would do that for them and then they, they, they got a company from Ethiopia, another one from Uganda and also they got in touch with us but we were the ones that they decided to. So what what, what, what I'm doing or what we are doing is at every point in time to try and make the brand as visible as possible. Nowadays the ads that we do are not necessarily to get clients or to get customers, it's to push the brand out there. And it is the same strategy that we have done and we have now deployed to Africa. And we now project the same brand, T-Shirt Factory Africa now, to the African continent. And over time, 
in recent times we've been getting inquiries in that direction. There's, we've sent t-shirts to the US, we've sent t-shirts to the UK, like I said, we've also sent to Paris. We have then sending inquiries about us producing t-shirts or producing tops that are produced here in Africa. They just want t-shirts or clothing produced by Africans. And so that's that, that we have been doing and that would not have been possible if the brand was not projected out there, was not lifted up like I said earlier. So the big picture, and I, I, I won't necessarily say this is what we want to do or that is what we want to do. All I can say is that I'll keep pushing the brand out there and be ready for any opportunity that comes. Thank you.